Wow, uh, I tried to push on the swim. Um, and I was happy that I was not alone. I was with Christoph. So we went uh, both on the bike and I was really glad because he was pushing really hard, Christoph with me. So he was doing most of the work. And uh, for that, I, I thanked him. After the bike, I think we had uh, two minutes uh, on the second group. So for me, it was, it was enough. And um, I tried to pace myself at the beginning and then I was feeling all right, so I stayed at the same rhythm all the time, and I was, I'm, I'm so happy uh, just to finish uh, first. Yeah, wow, uh, this is crazy because uh, I've been living uh, like 20 minutes away from here, and I'm so glad uh, that all my family, fans, friends, like just came to see me, and uh, just winning in front of them, it's something something special it's uh, it's unique i'm super happy with the with this place uh, i mean like three weeks or four weeks ago i nearly quit the triathlon i was like oh, i'm too shitty this year i'm done uh, the guys in front are too too strong for me and uh, but uh, i say yeah since two years this race uh, is always good for me so i just decide like give it a go and try to to do your best and you don't know what could happen, and yes, again, really happy. Crowdy is uh, always special, especially when, uh, when because my team is uh, less up, so yeah, the support was, is amazing. So yeah, thank, uh, thanks to the people out there, thanks to the organizer and all the volunteers, was like always a super race. Uh, for me, a special day, it's almost a victory for me. I know I'm not super talented like the others, and for me, a third place is a dream that come true. I think Pierre Lecour was yeah, out of the leap for us, and I know it was, everything was possible. I like the run course out and back. Uh, I like the, this uh, flat and fast. I'm not quite happy with the swim. I missed a little bit the start. Uh, I went a little bit too far uh, right, so I, I missed the big group and I had to catch it up. So it was not perfect, uh, but I managed to survive nicely. Uh, then the, the bike, I tried to break away in the first uh, part of the bike, but I didn't manage and I just say, okay, just to break, uh, try to be conservative and save my legs for the running leg. I know I could run really good, but it's uh, always the, the end of the race and it's always a bit of a surprise. You can have nice legs or really bad legs. So it was a surprise also for me, but it was a nice surprise and I just went all out and uh, it was fantastic. Yeah, it felt uh, amazing, right? I think I just realized that it was the same time I did in uh, Dubai in March, uh, which is uh, known to be the, one of the fastest race. So I guess I was uh, even a little faster today on a rolling uh, bike course. So I'm pretty happy. Average swim, let's say. I went uh, third out of the water, but with a big gap on uh, the first uh, girl. So yeah, the bike was a little weird because uh, the girls caught me uh, quite fast. I was quite surprised about how I felt about my legs at the start of the run. We started very fast. We tried, uh, I don't know what was the strategy, but we really started all out for the five first kilometer uh, with Charlene and, um, and then Marta caught up. And so I realized she was a very strong runner too and I couldn't follow her. And then I was just, okay, there is like 15k to go. I need to pace myself now and uh, I just did it pretty well until the end, so I'm happy with the new best time on the 21 kilometer. So that's pretty cool. I'm very happy that chair took the win as well. So it's a good day, good day for Les Sables. <laughs> oh, it's a very good race for me. Today, just I want to uh, uh, get a podium. Third place, uh, a very good uh, feeling for me, and I get a qualification of World Championship, and uh, it's a goal for me. Oh, in the last meter, I just uh, uh, feel uh, podium, uh, ambiance, uh, friends, parents, and uh, it's a very good moment for me. It was amazing, exhausting, incredible. I did it. I don't know. Oh, my, my sister said trust the training. She wasn't kidding. It was the most beautiful course. I, I don't think I can ever outdo this course. I didn't know if I made the cutoff time or not until I got out of the water. 
The bike course was amazing. The size of the cows, the houses, just, I, I was like totally engrossed in the course. Like the surroundings. After a while, I kept saying, I am in a race. I gotta like, come on, keep going. And I was kind of out sightseeing there for a while. And the run was spectacular. I recommend it for everyone. You know, if you're gonna grow old, do it. Make this the new way of life. I still can't believe I did it.